I have gathered here quite a variety of wedding images from different photographers with their different style of lighting and shooting. So you can see from details to exclusive portrait shots to dress up to reception and the whole lot. Some of the images you might have seen in the previous videos I did for the Capture One and the other wedding great video I did. So I did create this preset with wedding photography in mind. But as you all know, majority of my wedding presets can also work very well with your regular portrait you shot. So I'm going to go into test and these are also different images personally I shot over the years where I used, I think I was trying to promote another preset and I used these images to promote that particular preset. So I'm going to also show you how the preset I'm about to show you guys today will work on these images too so yeah it's an all-rounder image sorry it's an all-rounder preset but basically or mainly it's for wedding photographers and it was supposed to be an upgrade of tjd wedding grade and i don't know why i didn't put it out but i think i feel this is the right time to let you guys have it naming presets are you know quite a headache so spare me the names you're going to see about some some are simple, some are, you know, very weird, like orate. And there's black, and there's cool, and there's deal, and there's lux, and there's pine. So these are one, two, three, four, five, six, yeah, six sets of wedding presets, all labeled under dot two eight. Why dot two eight? Another 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 day for another story. So I'm just going to run through the images, make a few adjustments to them. I want to quickly say this to everyone who purchases my presets or co styles or whatever products you buy from me. These are supposed to help serve as a base in the direction of how I go about coloring my pictures. If you need adjustments made, make those adjustments. They are not a one time fix. You can either change exposure, you can either change um, temperature, you can either change, you know, the list goes on and on. So, looking at this, I want to do a quick before and after just so you see how effective the presets are. So this is the before and this is the after. We are currently using Dale as you can see over here. Dale, I don't want to do anything to this because I can see my shadows lifted. My highlights have been dimmed now. I can see the divisions in the kit and as compared to the before. Let's jump to the next image which is this particular image let's run through this is ariate this is black this is cool this is deal lux and pine i'm torn between pine and deal right what the deal is doing what i love to see in the deal it, it sort of bumps up the greens gives it a bit more color and i like that tint of blue within the shadows and even hitting the skin tones and within the blacks so it's it's a blend between cyan blue and magenta and it sort of tells whatever color story from this particular image so i love it let's go to this image let's use orient right here in orient i'm going to open this and release the highlight open this up a tad bit and maybe reduce the temperature open it more the exposure more and i love how brown tony this image has gotten so it's already brown tone from the before but look at how it's popping out more i'm going to reduce the amount of blues in here because if you lift the blues, then it makes it more warm in the shadows. So I'm going to reduce the amount of blues here. And this is the before and this is the after. I'm in this mode. You can change the mode, the viewing mode. So currently this is the pure black to see a clear before and after without any distraction. This is the regular mode and this is the in-between. So hit l on the keyboard i don't know if it's going to show but what i'm seeing is what i'm telling you so yeah l on the keyboard in lightroom 
and you're going to have these different modes so let's go to the next image rotate it go to transform auto transform all right so let's see codeal black orate lax and pine these are all going to work on this particular image i stick with pine reduce the exposure open my shadows so we have it before and after great jump into this a reception image lax dale black i think i'll stick with lax another reception image let's stick with lax uh, it's just minor adjustment I mean, if you open the tabs over here, there's quite a lot going on. But if you take a look at the before and after, minor adjustments, some contrast, some color, sweet. Let's jump to this particular image. Deal works. What then I'll do is to put some radio photo on here and expose it a tad bit. All right, and create another radio filter. This time around, invert the radial filter and do this. Let's open this up a little bit. Okay, there we have it. If we want to change, I think the previous white balance was okay. All right, let's jump onto this particular image. Let's see Orient. Let's bring back the highlight. Open it up a little bit. And there we have it. All, all the presets support the slider option. So I'm going to hit on Orient. I'm going to reduce the amount of it. Then I'm going to open this. So you can see the difference in the before and after. We're still using Orient, but because there's the slider version available, you can you can you can reduce the amount of it how much you want the effect on the image we acquired a number of other pieces that will also work on this so open the haze and i'll go to tone curve then i'll release the blacks so yeah either one will work okay so let's see this i think this is sort of my favorite let's see coal oh coal also works let's see lax okay not for this one deal if you're going for this particular look this is a look i think i've been seeing online most of the time and i managed to recreate it just so i can have that as one of the presets i have created All right so there's quite a few things you can do to this then you have an image looking like this what i do when i'm editing because i want to see where i'm coming from and where i am heading to sometimes i like to keep some of the colors intact and some changeable like the greens like i don't mind the greens looking this way but the red i mind so i'm going to change the hue of the red to match what i'm seeing over here so warm it up a little bit and maybe a little bit of the saturation and there you have it so this looks cool for me and i'm good to go okay one of my favorites let's use this All right i like how it adds contrast it brings out the color it pops it uh, it takes away the annoying yellows we usually see in our image and let's see for Dale and there's also Dale, Dale is lifting your blacks I don't know, it, it sort of makes everything flat and flat not in the sense of contrast white or blacks flat as in, it's welcoming in a sense that's what I'm looking at when I'm using the Dale preset let's go to this image Co, deal lux 
the lux brings out the browns i love to see in the image so this is the before and this is the after before and after it even pops your skin even more and if you have a concern about how the color looks you can come right here and change the hue of the orange just to have that reddish skin tone you're looking for so yeah i can see it changing the outfit color also you can make those adjustments here too so there's that as you move in the yellows towards the yellow region and reducing the saturation because the room is made of a lot of yellows i tend to do that too so re reducing that of the green will also help and blues and purple and magenta and there we have it okay let's jump to this particular image let's do coal i just want to show you how the coal looks very good come back to basic reduce let's go to this mode so that you see what's happening reduce this uh, so this is a before and this is after before and after this particular image so let's go to orate first i mean for this particular image when i tried all the presets it really worked well so pine this is how the pine looks like this is how the lux looks like deal this is great deal looks very good it's sort of uh, desaturated blue but the blues are still in there and the magenta is trying to pop its face out there you know what let's pick deal go to radial filter and just warm them up right so i'm going to warm them up so i can have that look so i have that warm and as you can see very beautiful so the next thing i want to do is maybe pop the blues a little bit more and i have this beautiful image with my blacks lifted that's beautiful just beautiful for this particular image orate works black works cool i think i'll stick with cool for this and i'm going to reduce the exposure a little bit and i love it okay so let's go to this particular image also so i think the orate works for dark skin brides or dark skin models or dark skin subjects let me put it that way well your bride is your model whoever is in front of the camera is your model so orate looks very good deal lifts my blacks all right i'm getting to see the colors as they're supposed to look like and my whites are sort of dimmed or washed out that's the kind of look you're looking out for when you're using deal let's see lux lux sort of works for indoor images too so yeah look out for that if you purchase it let's reduce the highlights a little bit yeah so this is before lux and after lux let me rotate this yeah so before lux after lux this is one of my favorite images i got from gog photography see when i say every every part of the preset works on this particular image it's one of those images just like this right so let's go to this i'm going to use pine you start from pine this is how it looks like you start from you go to lux this is how it looks like you go to deal this is how it looks like you go to coal this is how it looks like you go to black solid just solid and orate beautiful so so beautiful i'm going to bring back my highlights maybe bump this up a little bit and add a tad sense of clarity and there you have it very good so this particular image also i think i'm going to go with black and i love the contrast the whole point of me choosing this particular image for today's tutorial was to show you how the black works very well one thing about the blacks if this this is something i found out recently with respect to how s-curves are created right i tried or i, I tried playing around with the s-curve where i created a curve right beneath the linear line over here and it gives a different feel to the image as you can see so 
there's that also i know i'm trying to show you my secrets but yeah that's what this channel is all about okay so let's go to this particular image i think i shot this particular image let's see how the or mm, beautiful I, I i did say it works very well on dark skin let's go to lux i'm torn between orate and lux let's see deal okay not deal for this one there's a lot of greens in there which can be fixed so coal black lux pine i think between orate and lux i'm going to go with lux lux works for me now let's go to this particular image this from focus and blair so orate very beautiful so when i choose orate what i'll do then because i've reduced the highlights in the presets i'll just bring back the highlights and what i can also do is to reset the temperature then when i reduce the temperature make it a little bit more cold you can see the separation happening there's already a lot of separation going on in this particular image but the moment you apply the presets and you make a few adjustments like changing the temperature resetting the highlights and obviously resetting the tint you're going to find yourself looking at a very good image well produced that's a beautiful shot kudos to focus on blur okay so a little bit crop fix it a little bit beautiful now let's go to this image from gog photography so orient beautiful just just look at how you know what a quick before and after hit on orient see before and see after it works so well on brown skin and i'm not capping about it take a look at that beautiful let's see deal there's also deal i like what the deal is doing to the skies let me okay let me keep it there maybe increase the white and warm it up a little bit all right go to calibration and add some more reds to this yeah these are the adjustments i'm talking about very very good and last but not least before we jump onto the other image the other set of images so this is deal on a reception look i shot this particular image for gog photography cool this orange very beautiful it pops out all the reception colors you're seeing right there's pine and there's lux i think i think lux works very well on reception images so yeah look out for that too so let's just just look at that look at that look at all these images very very well colored okay let's go to the test come back here there's this particular image i want to show you how deal looks on this so with this image let's see deal this is deal so before hit on deal so this is before deal and after deal i like what the blues are doing i like how the skin tones are separated how the shadows are lifted the blacks are lifted the greens are popping that's crazy with deal there's this other image also so we can do deal on this and take a look at it before and after i like how cool tone this deal is working let's see lux lux warms it up a tad bit let's see cool okay cold blows it out let's see orient easy again dark skin it's popping the color like i want it to pop very beautiful very very beautiful let's look at another image this will orient it pops out the red color the red skin very beautiful there's another image also so this i think pine wax Look at how it cleans the white, warms it up, brings out the skin tones from this part. The brown, the brown guys, the brown. So let's see Lux. Let's see Deal. Cool tone. Deal. That's 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 what you're for. Cool. Orate and black. Beautiful. Just beautiful. I don't know if you guys remember this particular image. Let's see. Let me transform it first. And let's see what works. Orate looks very beautiful. I'm not going to lie. 
black we already know how black and white works and this is a different version of my black and white there are some tones going on in my shadows and my highlights that's one thing i love about this particular black and white so there's cool i like how the cool pops out the image it brings you know it brings the color back into the image all the dullness in the before you see the pop in the after let's see deal okay let's see lux pine i think i'll go with pine for this particular look it looks cool it looks sweet i love the tones everything is great very beautiful let's go back i think there's one last image so i'll wait for this and take a look at the skin tones man this is before this is after again my what my presets usually can be all rounder you just have to know what you're doing and i believe everybody on my youtube channel knows what they are doing i'm looking for one last image let's see this let's use black for this take a look at that guys take a look at that so yeah this is what i wanted to show you guys what i have been holding on for a very long time and i don't know i was just finding it difficult to put it out i don't know if it was just the fact that people are not going to purchase it or not it was supposed to be an update to the tjd wedding grid and i don't know how many of you use a wedding grid for other images but this also will work on other images that you have shot can be indoor can be outdoor even in the studio i think i tried it in one of my i tried it with some images i shot during the radiance fair and i think i'm going to put it up for you guys to see how they look they look very good and yeah you can use them all around all you have to do is make sure you understand what you're doing the adjustments and everything when you purchase them you can run through the tabs over here to see what's happening adjust them to see what will work best and what will not work best for you then you choose a different one thank you so much for watching today's video make sure you subscribe like and share link in the description to buy this the first 10 people i'm going to get i think how many how, how much discount am i supposed to get the first 10 people are supposed to get 30 percent off the original price so if you're watching this and you're part of the first then jump onto the link in the description box below enjoy using these set of dot 28 presets and i'll see you when i release the next one maybe next year subscribe bye